Let's talk about the turtle helmet. If you didn't know, you can craft this amazing turtle shell helmet and get some really cool properties. Like for example, underwater breathing, free of charge. And this thing is stronger than an iron helmet, so it's a really good helmet, extra potion effect, let's get you one. First thing to note, this helmet is kinda hard to get. Like for example, this is my five year old survival world, I still don't even have one. So yeah, it takes some patience, but let's get started. All right, you're gonna wanna find some turtles. And that was painfully obvious, Farzy. Turtles spawn on any kind of beach in Minecraft, so go find a big sandy area somewhere near the water, and you'll hopefully find turtles pretty shortly. And here we go, a gaggle of turtles right here. Now to make a turtle helmet, you need to get a certain kind of drop from these turtles and put that in a crafting bench. This drop is called Scoot. You get Scoot when a baby turtle grows up into an adult, but that is kind of a rare instance. So really important advice, if you see a baby turtle in the wild, go to him, keep him safe. It'll save you so much time. If not, take out some seagrass and you gotta breed these guys manually. Now when turtles go to mate, they don't just breed and drop the baby out, they lay an egg. Hence why this is such a long process, cause check this out, they're gonna dig in the sand and eventually lay an egg and then the egg has to hatch. Any day now. And boom, there we go, the egg is finally hatched. Now here's where the patience kicks in. It takes about four to five Minecraft nights on average for the eggs to hatch. Also note, you can't leave the eggs alone. You have to stay near them because mobs like to try and trample these. Because for some reason, Mojang said, yes, let's make this even harder to get the turtle shell. Yep, this sounds fair, doesn't it? Now once these eggs hatch, you'll have this little creature here. That's why at the beginning I said, if you can find him naturally, it's so much easier. But once you have your baby turtle, get some seagrass and feed him. Feed him like he's never been fed before. This is because seagrass on the baby turtle speeds up his growth process and he drops the scoot, which is the crafting recipe to make the thingy, the helmet, when he grows up. But yes, that's how you get scoot. Now go do that four more times. Because yes, unfortunately, you need five of these things in a helmet shape to make the turtle helmet. And a few scoots later, we have our turtle shell helmet. Isn't that nice fit? Isn't that beautiful? Now here's a pro tip for you if you want to get more scoot quickly for a little bit of a farm. Just make some walls here and encase a bunch of turtles in one small space. Because this way all the turtles have protection from the walls and they're easier to breed. They can't get away in the water. So much easier. It's a turtle breeding party. It's a turtle breeding party. YouTube don't demonetize me. And if your helmet's taking damage like mine is, you need to use scoot to repair it in the anvil. So once again, getting scoot's annoying but it's necessary. Now, if you intend to just wear the helmet, you're done. You can leave. Goodbye. But if you want to hear about the super secret turtle potion, you're going to want to stick around a little bit longer. Take out your brewing stand, get some awkward potions in there, and throw that turtle shell in the brewing stand to make a very interesting kind of potion. Let's take a big old sip of Potion of the Turtle Master. Now, as you see, this thing slows your speed down a lot, but you get so much resistance. So this is great if you're doing like close range PVP in like a small area. You get so much less damage taken, but you're so slow too. Let's experiment. Take a slug of this thing, blow me up. Only two hearts of damage, I laugh in your face. I also walk so slow. Can I sprint? Oh, that's all I can do. <laughs> I'm like slow motion. There we go, it wore off. So yeah, guys, that's the ultimate guide to getting the turtle helmet in Minecraft. What are you doing up there? I gotta get that helmet in this world so I can go deep sea diving without drowning. That'd be great. <laughs> if you want to see more helpful tutorials like that, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell. So on that note, like, subscribe, do all the good stuff, and I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.